Liz is still asleep, but if you want, I can put those in her room for you. Actually, they're for you. I know this um, probably isn't an anniversary to celebrate, but I wanted you to know that I hadn't forgotten. You know, what you did was um, just really generous, and uh, you know, I'm offering to be a surrogate for me and Courtney. It was a real gift. Thanks, Jackson. I didn't think anybody remembered. We all made a lot of mistakes last year. And everyone working on their own selfish motives. Except for you. You were always honest. Well, when it comes to protecting those you care about, it's not always easy being completely honest. It's funny how you keep secrets and they turn into lies, and <laughs> it's all in the name of love. Yes, and then when the truth finally does come out, it's always a lot worse than if you'd just been honest to start with. You know, in spite of what happened, I really wanted that baby. And uh, I'm sure it would have changed a lot of things. Jax, don't, don't do that. Don't play the what if game. Okay. Just glad that uh, you know you were able to move on, that we were all able to, to move on. Yeah. yeah. How's Lucky? Um, he's not really doing well. I know that he was never comfortable with, with you carrying my child. Sorry for that. Lucky always wanted a child of her own. The next General Hospital. Elizabeth! You didn't get the uh, flowers I sent. Or my invitation to dinner. We keep her sedated much longer. She runs the risk of permanent brain damage. Then we have to wake her up. I say we wait. What do you think? 